So Rachel surprised me with a Christmas card and three mystery assorted gifts here. Right now she's at the gym. So I wanted to record this so that she could see my reaction when I go through this. Cuddle time with my bae. <laughs> so when me and Rachel were first together, I always actually called her bae and every, she hated it. She thought it was the most annoying thing in the world, but that's kind of why I did it. So that was kind of a cute card. All right, so the first one, jingle all the way. What is it? Ah, oh, what? So we decorated our tree last night and they had a ton of ornaments, her and Jack's, her son, and I don't have a whole lot of those from when I was younger. It's an uh, ornament for starting the family. I think that's cute. That's really sweet. Makes sense why she got owls as a card. <laughs> Here goes the second one. Oh, this is so cool. I don't think she meant to put the price on it, but I don't care. This is so cool. Look, it's a little snowman. It's a little snowman. I've never had anything really sentimental. I I think part of me has always thought things were replaceable, but these things are Really cool. Now the final one. The uh, bench press and some dumbbells. I've never ever seen these before. These are so cool. She she did a <laughs> she did a really good job with this. So I think this is really cool. Yeah. Well, I wanted to share that. So just kind of give you an idea. So really cool. I have a pretty amazing fiance. Say hello. Hey. What are we doing right now? Um, we're gonna go to Joe. What time is it? 5.30 in the morning and I hate it. But that's life. I wanna do legs. No. But we're doing shoulders. Shoulders and triceps. My hair looks really good. For being 5.30 in the morning. Rachel and Rock Show. Now to the gym. Come on, let's get up. What's up guys? So we just wanted to share this quick uh, shoulder workout. We actually had to end up going separately just because the time that we had um, had some things come up, but we um, were able to get a few in. So I'll show a couple from me and a couple from Rachel. So we typically start with a lateral dumbbell raise and then into a front dumbbell raise. And you'll notice we kind of start at the dumbbell rack and then we usually go over to like a machine um, and then cables we usually end things with. Sometimes a little bit different if we're going to warm up. Sometimes we use the cable machine first. But for shoulders, typically we start with a uh, heavier dumbbell exercise. So uh, as of now, I've been starting with doing shoulder press first. But for this exercise, I did kind of an alternating between a dumbbell uh, lateral raise and the front. Raise. Super important to stretch before these exercises. Just make sure you warm up correctly. Don't just go straight in. 
Now I do a seated shoulder raise. This is something I like to do to really build on my delts. So uh, make sure that your form stays accurate with this with your butt up against the seat and your back being straight. Now, one of the techniques that Rachel likes to use with the cable machine is she likes to basically do a pull down and this uses your the front of your delts. So make sure that when you do this exercise that you isolate that part of your body. You really want to think with that part. You want to avoid using triceps or lats. So your upper back when you're using this armpit. So just make sure that you keep attention to that. Typically after dumbbells, we'll go to the cable machine and we will start with this exercise. It's just a lateral raise and it gives you a full range of motion. So you really do not need a lot of weight, but Trust me, you can definitely feel this one. So this is a very good exercise and it's been really helping me grow my delts. Rachel loves easy bars when it comes to shoulders. So this is what she likes to do for her upright rows. I typically use the cable machine as a different variation, um, but I'll switch between the both of them just to give myself a little bit of a different feeling when I'm doing it. And just that kind of gives a good point of just making sure to change it up. Uh, don't ever stick with the same thing. Try different things. That's how you get the results. Afterwards, we usually end on a shoulder burnout, and that's what you're seeing here with the easy bar. And naturally, with any chest or shoulder exercise, you use your triceps. So I usually burn them out. I usually start with a rope extension on the cable machine, and then I will go to a reverse grip and with the reverse grip it's a little difficult you have to make sure to really uh, isolate it just because it can be kind of hard range of motion especially with my non-dominant arm as you see here so yeah but anyways i hope you guys enjoyed this video uh, make sure to like subscribe and share thanks for watching see you next time